well, the geeks and nerds are going to have to develop people skills. So for example, there, there's one program that uh, is a, a data analytics program, uh, graduate program. And what they're doing is they're having their geeks and nerds uh, take improv comedy classes to try to develop their interpersonal abilities. Uh, that's, we're going to see more of that. You know, the people who are, are in those kinds of jobs are going to have to get more people oriented. So for example, one of the things that, that uh, uh, Minghui Huang and Max Maximovich and I uh, did was we took a look at what was happening to some key jobs. For example, financial analyst. Now you would think, financial analyst, that sounds pretty analytical. Sounds like that's somebody who's really a geek, you know, that's good with numbers and all that. What we found out was that the feeling aspects of that job are increasing very fast at the expense of the analytical parts. And uh, at a, a conference we were, uh, where we were uh, not long ago, we were talking to somebody from that industry. And uh, he was saying, yes, you know, you're, you're absolutely right. Uh, I notice right now, uh, in my job, I really let AI do all the technical stuff. And my job is more hand-holding and uh, reassuring people, making sure they don't panic about their investments, that sort of stuff. So it's, it, uh, the nature of jobs is uh, changing. And uh, what we like to say, uh, what Ming Hui and I like to say, is that uh, what's happening is that uh, the people are being upgraded. They're being upgraded to a higher intelligence level. Uh, and by higher, we mean harder for AI to do. So uh, the easiest stuff for AI to do is the mechanical stuff. The second easiest for AI to do is the analytical stuff. And then the hardest for AI to do is the feeling stuff.